With Smart Speed PT and Smart Jump, you as a coach can set one form of feedback parameter for your athlete to achieve during their jump. And they are going to hear an audible cue whether they have or they have not achieved that parameter. On the application, you as a coach are going to see a green value whether your athlete has achieved the parameter that you've set or a red value indicating that they have not achieved the parameter that you have set. Now we're going to see an example of that with a vertical jump. Let's go, Dan. Beautiful. With Smart Jump Light, you as the coach can set two feedback parameters for your athlete to meet, and the athlete is going to hear and see two separate feedback parameters. The sound, like Smart Speed PT, but also visually to the lights on a Smart Hub. We're going to see an example now with a drop jump followed by three pogo jumps. Let's go, Dan. Beautiful, mate. So that's the example and the difference between Smart Jump Lite and Smart Jump with Smart Speed PT. The data that you have, the exact same. The software that you're using, the exact same. The only difference is in session, the two different types of feedback. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.